Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays my friends. Today on another pop review we're going to be taking a look at the pop movies Home Alone number 492. This is Harry. Ho ho ho. Welcome back to Come Again TV is the only place on YouTube where all geek culture collides. I'm Santa Claus and if you're new to the channel don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on future videos. Ho 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 ho. As I said today, we're taking a look at the Pop Movies Home Alone 492 Harry Vinyl Figure. Um, now I could be wrong. It's been a little while since I've watched the movie. I only watch it once a year. But I could have sworn that Harry's hat head only got burnt in the second film, not in the first. Like I said, I could be wrong though. So maybe they should have made this Home Alone 2? I want to say... Again, I could be wrong. But here's a nice little window side. Another window side. The back. Uh, 491 is Kevin McAllister. 492 is Harry. 493 is Marv. And then, nice little display side. Very Christmassy. I'm not quite sure why they put the red down here it looks a little off when you have it displayed on this side with the rest of the pops um, I don't know may, maybe it would be good displayed next to uh, the pop animation uh, Sailor Moon pops or Rainbow Bright uh, because they have that bar down below uh, whereas the others like uh, like my horror pops or my DC Heroes pops they don't really have a bar like this down below uh, the Sailor Moon pops have a little blue bar here and the Rainbow Bright has a rainbow colored bar so I don't know so it looks a little off when displaying them uh, next to pops that don't have the bar With that being said, let's go ahead and open them up and take a look inside. As you can see with Harry, I have him kind of uh, resting up against the back of my backdrop. And that's because now he's wanting to stand. Uh, but he's really top heavy. So if you don't get him standing perfectly flat, perfectly level, he will topple backwards. They really should have included a display stand with him. But as you can see here, the top of his hat, uh, after he got burnt with the um, the torch uh, and got his hat burnt off as well as some of his hair, uh, red around the center of his head. Very nice. 
Um, got the little bags under his eyes, which is cool. Holding the flashlight. His head does turn all the way around. Uh, he's in his uh, trench coat with his button-up shirt and vest, scarf, and slacks with the black boots or shoes, whichever. I'm not sure which, but very nice. Uh, they did make his hairline in the back kind of lopsided and awkward. If you can tell that. Kind of comes down to a slant. They should have brought this side down a little bit or maybe this side up a little bit. But overall, not a bad pop. Uh, I found this at Mega Replay. It was in the 3 for 15 bin uh, alongside Marv and Kevin which I kind of struck out on that because I had all three of them on my wish list for Amazon so that I could do uh, some Christmas pop reviews this year. Um, so obviously I'm going to do this one, I'm going to do Marv, I'm going to do Kevin as well as Clark W. Griswold. So there you have it guys, this was the Pop Movies Home Alone 492 Harry Vinyl Figure. Thanks for tuning in to Comageddon TV, the only place on YouTube where all geek culture collides. If you enjoy this video, make sure you hit that subscribe button right there so you don't miss out on future videos. You can also take a look at one of these two playlists on the side to stay up to date on all things geek culture. Merry Christmas! Ho 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 ho!